Hello, in this video, I would like to show you how to upgrade this uh, 8.4 inch Mitsubishi screen from two CCFL to our UB35 series LED kits. This kit comes with a two LED strip to replace the CCFL lamp, one LED driver to replace your original um, CCFL inverter, and then one six pit tail wire which is connected to this one. It's all color coded where it's for the input voltage. Yellow enable, black for ground, white for adjustment, usually there's no con connections. Alright, let's set aside LED key for a second and take a look at the screen. This screen actually is a uh, made by Mitsubishi. Okay. And the screen number is AA084XA03. It's a 8.4 inch, really nice screen. They have a 1024 by 768. To remove the lamp is quite easy. You see in this, I want to try to show it to you. This clicks here. So you push it down. You push it down. Grab the wire. Just pull out like this. Okay. Same thing on this one. On this side. You push it down. And then you pull out. There you go. Okay. So it's already out. And take a look at this one. Now this one is not going to fit in the reflector, so we had to mount it back to the same location uh, without the reflectors. So let's take a look here. First thing we need to remove this cable and then this cover. So we had to remove this uh, metal frame out. Okay. So first thing first. Okay. So first we're going to peel off this cover tip a little bit here just to loosen up to get a screw see this okay so we're gonna take it out okay. this is only this plastic um, protective film it's oops only covers I mean it was oops double side tape here so you can just peel off uh, this and same thing I think we had to remove this first I show you um, if you want to, you can use a knife to cut it off, but I usually will, I can tip it back. Okay, this one, okay. Alright, so this one, also on this end too. Because that's the requirement that we have to take the metal frame out. So this is powder. Alright, so this one's out. This one, you just flip the switch, or flip the clip here. See that? Till it and remove it. All right. Now, so, yeah, just use this one to carefully remove the metal film one side at a time. Uh, yeah. And this side too. Make sure you don't touch the circuit board, okay? Yeah. Well, there we go. Okay, we take it out. Take it out. We're gonna probably uh, use a piece of cardboard to transport this liquid glass. That's what I usually do, and I don't mess it up this so. time. Alright, okay, so this one have a screw. I need to remove the screw here. Okay, put it here, screw, screw, okay, oops, so, yep, so we can take it out, oops, before we do that, it looks like there's something here, there's a, oh, here we go, so we loosen up. Now, see, you, you see what I mean? It's easy to transport, you know. I set it aside. Alright, so let's take a look at this thing. Because we had to mount right back here. So we had to remove this plastic too. So, let's see. And there's a couple of screws that we need to remove, which are holding the plastic frame. After we remove the plastic frame, we should be able to do it. Now 
let's remove it. Here we go. Let me see. Oops. Let me get the whole stack. Put the top of the liquid glass. This is a uh, diffusion sheet. All right. 